Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And um, when we talk about computers and devices, we often talk about the operating system that comes with it. So, you know, you've got a Mac, you know, Mac OS. Uh, you've got an iPad, an iPhone. Well, you know, it's iPad OS or iOS. Uh, PC guys have Windows and some have Linux. And most of the devices that are sold that are smart devices have some form of an operating system on them. But notice one thing. We talk about operating systems when we talk about computers. We do talk about some operating system like Android on phones and tablets and so on. But most smart devices, you'll notice that we rarely talk about what operating system it's running. An example, I've got a Samsung TV here, and that smart TV has an operating system. It, it has to. I got also another one, which is a TCL, Chinese uh, smart TV, which uh, runs Android. But we don't talk about that like that. We don't. We never really uh, specify that. And the reason I'm talking about this is comes from a question about, well, do you think browsers will eventually be something that is going to go out. We're not going to use browsers anymore. And um, whether it's Google Chrome or Edge or uh, Brave or whatever operating system, uh, whatever browser, sorry, we use, um, it is the entry to the Internet for us. And that's the thing, is that um, it's actually the operating system that will slowly lose over the next decades. In the next 10, 20, 30 years, smart devices will be dominant. We will have smart devices of everything. You'll even probably have a smart toaster, a, you know, a, 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 a smart oven, and a smart fridge, and a smart TV, and, and everything will just be called smart something. Obviously, they run an operating system, but we never and don't talk about these devices like that. But they all have, or a lot of them will have, a browser. And I think that's where the future is, is the browser. And whatever browser it is, um, one of the things that is happening is more and more of what's happening isn't a program that you download and install on a device anymore. More and more, what's happening is a web interface that does what you want to do, which means that instead of downloading, I, I, I had an example yesterday, I was I actually downloaded a astronomy program called Stellarium, which is great. But when I actually searched for the download page, I noticed that there was a Stellarium web website and noticed that it's Stellarium, but it runs in the browser. You don't even need to download anything anymore. And that is the future. The future will be, we don't care what OS you run, we'll run it in the browser. And it is way better that way. Why? Because it doesn't care what operating system you're running. One of the biggest problems that's been all the time is what? Oh, well, this is only Windows, or this is only Mac, or this is only Linux, or this, you know, and it's always been a plague. It's like, well, I'm running Linux, and I don't have that category, that choice. I'm running a Mac OS. Oh, well, you know, that is a Windows-only um, program. Well, that will fade away. There won't be any more. Uh, it's only for this. It will be, it works as long as you have a browser. And that is the future of computing uh, for most people. You'll just use a browser and you'll have the interface of whatever you want within that browser. Um, so that's where um, the browser will get more and more popular. Now, depending on the devices and what we run, the browser could, you know, that browser war, which is mostly a, um, desktop PC and, and you know, for certain devices, uh, kind of a war. But um, remove computers, 
whatever the browser is going to be in that device. For example, on my TV, it's some kind of weird browser, but it works and it goes online and it does what I want. Uh, this is going to be the future. And that future will mean it doesn't matter what you run on. As long as you get a browser, you'll be able to do what everybody else does. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.